Well, used car prices have been on the rise for several months, and they rose dramatically last month. Our Matt Lackert shares the swings the car industry has gone through in the past year. When COVID hit, it completely changed the car industry. Dean Cagle has worked in the business for 45 years. At the height of the pandemic, prices went down and cars were plentiful, but now that's changing. It started about four or five months ago, really, the, 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 the steady upward climb. Prices are up across the board and the increases are affecting both dealerships and individual purchases. Toby Troquill bought a truck here just a few weeks ago. House of Cars is always very competitive, but it seems to me the prices are going up across the board. Cars are in such short supply, and that's a two-fold problem, but some of it's because the new car dealers don't have the inventory they used to have, and so they have to hang on to the trade-ins that, that they can get, and so those cars are not available for independent used car dealers. Kegel says a car he sold for $10,000 last year could sell for 20% higher right now. I'd say in this area, It'd probably be, be 12. A year ago, Cago says this 2018 Chevy Silverado, he would have sold for roughly 26,000, maybe 26,5. But today, that same car, they have listed for nearly $30,000. Statewide, according to the Lily Max Texas Business Report, researchers at UBS found that used car prices shot up around 8 to 9 percent. We've got you covered, East Texas. Matt Lackritz, CBS 19. If you are looking to buy a used car, Cagle says now's a good time to buy, but make sure you do the proper research before making a big decision.